känns ju som en stor fest att få ha ett mästerskap på hemmaplan och Bohuslän är ju ett av de mest fantastiska naturområdena som finns i Sverige så jag ser verkligen fram emot det. Vilken terräng är det som du kommer se allra mest fram emot? Det är de här sönderskurna, tuffa Bohuslänsbergen som man behöver forcera på långdistansen som känns som det är allra mest utmanande. TLA Shoshu, what are your expectations for walk in Sweden next year? So a really big of course because uh, I remember very well the last walk in Sweden in 2004 it was uh, very big for me and uh, I hope the competitors will uh, get the same experience. What would be the toughest challenges? Uh, it's a very tough terrain. Uh, I think you need a lot of hours of training in this type of terrain to to get really good so yeah it will be a lot about uh, having a good preparation. What are you most looking forward to? I haven't yet decided if I will be competing next year, but uh, of course if I'm competing, uh, I'm looking for this uh, amazing atmosphere. I expect a lot of spectators and uh, Sweden now feels a little bit like home. So yeah, if uh, I'm competing next year, of course uh, I want to be there. Great. Maja Alm, tre guld i detta VM. Nu blir det en VM i Sverige nästa år. Vad har du för tankar inför det? Jeg ser rigtig meget frem mod øh, VM i Sverige. Øh, jeg synes, at i år har været rigtig godt arrangeret, og jeg forventer mindst lige så høj standard næste år. Hvilken terræn venter du? Jamen, det bliver noget øh, nordisk, øh, rigtig tungt, og det er i hvert fald noget, der bliver en stor udfordring for mig. Så jeg skal hjem og lægge et hårdt arbejde for at blive god i, i svensk terræn. Hvor ser du aldrig mest frem imod? Jeg tror næsten, det må være sprinten. Øh, jeg synes, Sverige har ofte lidt... Øh, Ry for at have lavet lidt lette sprinter, men jeg tror, når det er VM, så skal det nok være på plads, og det glæder jeg mig til. Ja. Daniel Hubman, uh, next year it's walk in Sweden. What are your expectations for that? Ja, yeah, in Sweden you always expect a nice terrain and a very good competitions, so I hope everything will be well organized. What are you most looking forward to? Ja... Yeah. That's a difficult question. Of course, uh, yeah, to run in nice terrain, that's always uh, my main motivation to go to a World Champs. And yeah, I hope many spectators will be there, that it will be a big uh, happening in the Swedish orienteering uh, history. What would be the biggest challenges? Yeah, the Swedish terrain is always tough for us Swiss runners. We need to prepare for it because at home we don't have a similar terrain. But I think we will do that and hopefully we'll be ready in one year. <laughs>